Found it at the bait school again, and just with the big sinking line, just thrown it out, fed more line out, so it's going to make sure it sinks down. And uh, a nice old whack on the that little mylar minnow. I just love it. Been so deep, not sure what it was. Another pinky. So they're just going to be hanging just underneath the uh, the school. The, the little white baits that uh, are injured. Yep, so there you go. So a good little... Uh, there you go, got away. But that's what we're doing. Big school there. I'm not sure whether you can... you can We can see them here with our good Polaroids on, but there's a um, whole school of bait fish there that probably go down about 10 metres. And uh, we're just working our flies down below them and uh, the fish down below are mopping up, you know, what's getting injured along the way. So uh, it seems to be working, so we'll keep doing that. Catch a bigger one. That's amazing. I mean, you can, I, I'm sure you could see this on your screen, but where it's all black is those tiny little um, white bait or pilchards, and they're just thick. There's got to be millions and millions just in that one little area. And we just need the fish to get onto them. So uh, we're in the right place. We just need the fish to uh, work out where this right place is. As you can probably see, a bit of a difference now. We uh, fished up until near on lunchtime and there wasn't really much action. She was hard work, so we stopped and had lunch and come back and it's everything's altered. The wind's died down, the bait fish have moved right in into the shallows and the birds are working like all around. And there's a few fish starting to really pop up on these bait fish as well. So they're right up near the surface and that's what salmon fishing is about. That's what's exciting when it, you can see it. It's all pretty visual. So um, just as Ed will pan around now and just show you the birds right up against, you know, it's pushed that bait school right up onto the bank there and they'll get in there and slash it. So uh, we've got to be as close to where all that action is and because uh, they'll move around, we've got to be on the go as well and try and put our fly right in front of it. But um, this is the exciting time. When, you, when you've got the big schools and they're feeding, you really got to go and get in there and get your fly in amongst them. And uh, that's when it gets pretty exciting. So uh, with a bit of luck, we'll hook onto one pretty soon. There. Yeah, there you go. Well, that's uh, what it's all about. That's what salmon fishing's about. We've got action everywhere. And uh, there was a bit of a boil back there and you, you, you've just got to put that fly near him. and. Uh, Give them a tweak, it looks different. What these birds will do and the fish, they'll break up this big school of bait and they'll get the smaller little little schools to, to work their way around and then they'll come in and ambush them. So uh, he's seen that fly 
and uh, he's, he's decided he wanted to have it. And that's, uh, that's what it's all about. And you'll just see, like all around us now, there's these there's sloshes as they're, uh, they're going to take the, um, the other white bait all around there. And it, it'll be a reasonable sort of fish. I mean, he's not going to be a monster, but he'll be, you know, a good pound, pound and a half. And just great fun. And you know there's a million more of them. You just see him just down there. Just a good solid fish. Plenty of go in him. This is where you're using an eight weight, which is, I mean, you can get away when it's nice and calm with probably even a six like your trout gear, but this makes it a bit easier to cast if there's a breeze or heavier flies. And at the end of the day, you want to hook these fish, get them in and get another one. That fly out there, but they love that little white bait pattern. But just a slightly bigger, still a little bay trout, little salmon. Get him back in and get his mum and dad. There you go, there's another one. Just drifting along again. Um, there's quite a, I think the fish have now like spread out a little bit. There's not too much surface activity now. And just got another one. They seem to be all around about the same size, which, um, which yeah, haven't got the big mothers yet. So, uh, but still good fun. Even the little ones just on a, uh, on the fly. I just love that that, uh, that white bait pattern. So just a lovely little uh, bait trout on the salmon. We'll get him back in. Happy as Larry. Still got to find his mum. Cool. 